The smartest quotes ever said. One, we suffer more in our imagination than in reality. By Seneca. Two, it's never too late to be what you might have been. By George Eliot. Three, our life is what our thoughts make it. By Marcus Aurelius. Four, thinking is difficult. That's why most people judge. By Carl Jung. Five, care about what other people think, and you will always be their prisoner. By Lao Tzu. Six, a fool is known by speech, and a wise man by silence. By Pythagoras. Seven, if you are the smartest person in the room, you're in the wrong room. By Confucius. Eight, the quieter you become, the more you are able to hear. By Ruth. If you close your eyes and you place your attention on your heart, by paying attention to your heart, you're actually giving it your energy. Now do something really cool. Amplify. That's the amplifier. What do you want to feel? Like what emotion do you want to feel when a future experience happens? Whatever that is. Feel the gratitude. Feel the joy. Feel the freedom. Breathe and feel and feel and breathe and keep relaxing into your heart, keeping your attention nowhere else out of the millions of things you put your attention on. That's your target. There'll come a moment where that energy will naturally start moving up to the brain. When that happens, the survival centers shut down. The brain moves into alpha. You see more pictures and images. The heart sends this propagating wave right into the brain, telling the brain to be creative, to dream, to be unlimited. The more you do it, the more it becomes a skill. We tend to be more present and appreciative when we're truly in the state. Teach your body, just for 15 minutes a day, what it would like to feel gra feel gratitude, what it would be like. And our data shows that you take someone to do that for four days, three times a day. They make a immunoglobulin called immunoglobulin A. It's your body's natural flu shot. It's the greatest immune uh, chemical we have. 50% increase in four days. Where is that chemistry coming from? They're not taking anything. It's coming from within them, right? You could actually program your autonomic nervous system to make a pharmacy of chemicals that cause causes growth and repair to happen in the body. And that's exactly what we're discovering. And when you change your state of being like that every day, get ready. Because you're going to start having synchronicities and opportunities <laughs> and coincidences and weird things start happening in your life to prove to you that you're actually the creator of your life instead of the victim of your life. Absolutely. But have you heard of the law of inverse transformation? It states that if a circumstance can produce a certain psychological state, then a certain psychological state can produce a circumstance. Let me explain. If water can turn into steam, then steam can turn into water. If sound creates vibrations, then vibrations can create sound. If a plant can grow from a seed, then a seed can come from a plant. If heat can create fire, then fire can create heat. 
And the Bible tried explaining it 2,000 years ago by saying, Whatever you ask for in prayer, believe that you have received it, and you will be given it. key phrases for your notes. Here's the first one. Life and business is like the changing seasons. So life is like the seasons. Here's the second phrase. Very important. You cannot change the seasons, but you can change yourself. See, that's how life gets better for you. Not by chance, but by change. 